Take your head off, Jess. Come on now. What is that thing? Big horn. No idea what it's doing in these parts. Must have strayed from the flock. Five more. Looks scared. Yeah. Driven off by the storms, I reckon. I don't know about this. Can I take the shot? Uh-uh. Situation like this, you need to pay attention to your surroundings. Your mind will slip into that scope. Awareness will narrow to the head of a pin. You make sure while you're stalking that bighorn, you're still watching out for what's stalking you, baby. Good. Good, all right. All right, tell me what you're sensing. It's gonna rain soon. Good. What else? Uh, I don't know, there's a... There's a band of coyotes about 100 yards northeast of here. Five more, Zofia, kick! Kick! <sighs> Keep your hands up. Again. No, no more, Mama. This is how you die. This is the moment they get you. We die because we let them kill us. You will face a big, strong Aryan true believer who can push through pain for one second longer than you do. And that's all it takes. When does it stop, Mama? Listen, Kokanya, to survive is to embrace the suffering, to stand up and carry it. Okay? Teraz jeszcze pięć. Five hey, more. Nie bać to. Hey, language Sofia. Daddy. Yep. What else? Daddy? Are you leaving? awareness. It'll save your life. Come on now. Take your shot before the rains come. I was beginning to think you lacked that killer instinct. Screw you, Arthur. Ah, uh -uh, girls, you be nice to each other. Come on. <laughs> what? It's a compliment. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Our girls are young women now. When did that happen? What's the matter, darling? Scalpel? So you girls are sisters, c'est bien ça? Twin, Twin sisters. sisters. Mm. Daughters of the famous Captain Blaskovich himself. Except for Abby here, she's a friend of the family. We know he was here, ma'am. He came here looking for something, and then he helped us fight the Nazis, and suddenly he was gone. Plus des terres, s'il te plaît, Jacques. You have antibiotics, Jack? Oh, poor Jacques, he's a mute. Why do you want antibiotics? He's got peritonitis. Oh, and how do you know this? Swollen abdomen, rapid breathing. His peritoneum is inflamed, which will eventually lead to sepsis and death. He needs antibiotics. Oh, you come over here, you in? I'm cool. Ma'am, please. Everyone calls me Juju. Will you help us find him, Juju? 
wearing power suits? Yep. We don't have anything like this here. Kenyana Lugal. Damn straight. Mm. Have you ever killed Nazis before? Listen, ma'am. We were born to kill Nazis. <laughs> Tonton Stajak. Born to kill Nazis. We ain't kill no Nazis. All right, Arthur, they don't need to know that. Very well, then. I may have an assignment suitable for two Nazi killers such as yourselves. After the previous General Lothar Brandt was ousted from power by Berlin, they send in a new general to fight the Paris uprising. This general is located in a Zeppelin called the Nachtfalter. Kill him first. Then we may proceed with finding your father. from up here. You're so not ready for this. You missed the shot. Shut up, I am ready. Yeah. yeah we should try to, try to get up close. Climb down there. I sneak up from the left. You sneak up from the right. Corner him and kill him. Man, are you crying? I'm fucking crying. A little nauseous is all. You could have flaked out on me. Hell no. Well, let's go then, little Miss Blaskowitz. Just do what Mama and Daddy would do. Keine Bewegung! Das wirst du noch bereit! Daddy's hurt, bleeding somewhere. We can do this. We can find him. Are you kidding me? We got this shit, sis. Fucking A. Remember, girls, you are the daughters of the man who killed Adolf fucking Hitler. You were born to do this. Your target, General Winkler, should be in the front end of the Zeppelin. Copy that, Abster.
Here they come, Jess. Looks like we need a code for these doors. Let's see if we can find it. We should find a computer so we can decrypt this. As I was saying, can you believe this? We're shooting Nazis on a fucking Zeppelin, dude. I wish Daddy could see us now. Totally, dude.
Winklers neue Motorrüstung gesehen? Hey, du! Jess, you went hunting with Dad. What did you talk about? I don't know, so. Why don't you go hunt with him yourself sometime? I only hunt Nazis, Jess, not animals. They make a computer this small with so much interest in stuff. How are you holding up, Jess? Fine, as 
cream gravy. Heads up, girls. Just got intel on the general. He's apparently trying out a new range of Nazi power suits. So be careful. All right? Sure thing, Abby. So help me out over here, will ya? I'm sleeping over. Cool. Children, can you give us a moment? <sighs> Children. Hey, what's that, Abby? A listening device. Looks like something out of Arthur and Kenneth. You built this thing? Yep. Who are Arthur and Kenneth? You're telling me you haven't read the covert adventures of Arthur Pennington and Kenneth Van Holshauser? Man, what rocket you've been living under? Here, take it. No time for reading fiction. So Arthur and Kenneth are super spies, right? And they go on. No, off. shut up, shut up. Listen. Calls, no letters, and I searched everywhere. He just vanished. Well, my agents informed me that he left the country under a false identity about four weeks ago. But after that, the trail went cold. Anya, did you notice anything peculiar? about his demeanor lately? No. I don't know. Depression, maybe. Sometimes he doesn't talk for a day. Just like in the asylum. You know how he is. Always brooding. 
Yeah. I can't go after him, Grace. I have to stay here and watch over my girls. You are the head of the FBI. Isn't there anything you can do? Listen, trust me, if there was anything any of the agencies could do, girl, you know I would be all over that shit. You know what the bottom line is? He doesn't want to be found, Anya. And if BJ fucking Blaskowitz doesn't want to be found, there is nothing and no one on God's green earth that's going to find his ass. Yeah. Yeah. It's fucked. Screw this. You will look for him. No one ever does anything. Losers. Got, no, we got to do something. What, what, what would Arthur and Kenneth do? Yeah, they're characters in a book, Jess. I, I know that, asshole. I'm thinking out loud. I'm getting something from upstairs. There's nothing up there. Whoa. Wow. None of you knew this was here? Negative. What the hell is this place? Check this out. That's Seth's handwriting. Who's this? Codename Blackbird. Paris Catacombs. There you have it. That's your lead. He's in Paris. You know, if we say something, they aren't going to do jack shit. Well, I guess it's just up to us then. I say, what time is it? I think it's time for Arthur and Kenneth to illustrate this sticky wicket. <laughs> Fuck yeah! Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys are weird. And it's a professional. <laughs> you think you're doing? We're going to the hamburger bar, mother. Abby, get back here right fucking now. You're breaking up. Abby! <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you something. Whoa. Where'd you get these power suits? Made them. All the Nazi generals have these nowadays, so you will need it. Holy fucking shit. You're pretty awesome, Abby. I just finished one of Seth's projects. It was his dying wish. I have more things I'm working on in the cargo hold. No wonder Grace wants you to join her advanced research division. Maybe she'll send you to Juvie instead. Sounded pretty mad you stole a ride. You think she cares what her mother thinks? I don't care what anyone thinks. Are you Blackbird? And who might you girls be? Oh. I do not want to do that shit again. Well, stewardesses, just like Daddy told us. Winkler is out of the picture. Now come back to the catacombs. Juju wants to talk to you. On it. Congratulations, Stop. girls. So General like, Winkler like, is like dead. <gasps> you really were born to kill Nazis, hmm? Well, you are the daughters of the man who killed Hitler. So it shouldn't be a surprise, I guess. This is a big step for the resistance. Come back to me, Ajac, so we can make plans for our next move. Juju out.
Hmm, need a code. Maybe check that guard booth? One code coming up. They've started evacuating so citizens. Left. Look at this place, totally deserted. It's like the end of the world or something. Sarah Jane stole your lunch money, Jess. Doesn't make her a Nazi. Yeah. Close enough. 